Hello and welcome to the course. My name is Danny Lewis and I'm the course developer of this course in Cubase. I'm going to do the same as before, functions, velocity, tidy as I go. Double click, let's get another one. And also I've got portamento on, which is bending the notes. Okay, so let me show you what it sounds like without that. Now the bending is the real key to this. So it's somewhere around here. And you can see the filter moving now. And then we have slow down. So what it's trying to do is to try and make things feel a little bit more human, a bit more kind of organic, less robotic. That's what would be happening if it was on simultaneous. Let's come back to this section. Bass sign coming from the Prolog, which is a virtual analog synth we're gonna look at later in the course. I've got a clap here coming from the Hallie on one. Okay, and uh, that's because I liked the sound of that clap on that particular drum kit. It's a very, very different method. This is all being done in real time, but the end result is the same as what we had before. So have a listen. So there's the old school flavor, literally the same sample, transposing up and down the keyboard, but it's actually multiple copies of the same sample, each with their own transposition via the coarse tuning knob. We've got the warm tone to start off with, then it opens up and becomes brighter over time. So that's a really nice effect. Let's take it off solo and listen to it in context. <laughs> 